John thirteen thirty four through thirty five A new commandment I give unto you, that ye love one another as I have loved you, that ye also love one another. By this shall all men know that ye are my disciples, if ye have love one to another. Jesus commanded that all Christians must love each other and be united together. We are to love each other because that's the way we will glorify Jesus. John seventeen nine through ten. I pray for them. I pray not for the world, but for them which thou hast given me. For they are thine. All mine are thine, and thine are mine, and I am glorified in them. Jesus went straight from telling the Father that he is glorified in the people the Father has given him in verse 10, to pleading with the Father for the unity and love his people need in verses 11 through 23. Five times in these thirteen verses, Jesus speaks of the need for his people to be united as one. See for yourself. John seventeen eleven through 23 And now I am no more in the world, but these are in the world, and I come to thee. Holy Father, keep through thine own name those whom thou hast given me, that they may be one as we are. While I was with them in the world, I kept them in thy name. Those that thou gavest me I have kept, and none of them is lost but the son of perdition, that the scripture might be fulfilled. And now come I to thee, and these things I speak in the world, that they might have my joy fulfilled in themselves. I have given them thy word, and the world hath hated them, because they are not of the world, even as I am not of the world. I pray not that thou shouldst take them out of the world, but that thou shouldst keep them from the evil. They are not of the world, even as I am not of the world. Sanctify them through thy truth. Thy word is truth. As thou hast sent me into the world, even so I also sent them into the world. And for their sakes I sanctify myself, that they also might be sanctified through the truth. Neither pray I for these alone, but for them also which shall believe on me through their word, that they all may be one, as thou, Father, art in me, and I in thee, that they also may be one in us, that the world may believe that thou hast sent me. And the glory which thou gavest me, I have given them, that they may be one, even as we are one, I in them, and thou in me that they may be made perfect in one, and that the world may know that thou hast sent me, and hast loved them as thou hast loved me. It is absolutely vital that we as Christians not talk down to each other or about each other. Every time we do, we show the unbelievers of this world that we do not belong to Jesus. If we show that we can't be united in our common faith in Jesus as our Savior, then we try to claim that we belong to the same Jesus. Then we give the unbelievers in this world good reason to call us liars. It doesn't matter whether that other Christian is from a different denomination than you are, or just someone who has a different way of looking at things than you. So don't tear down a person who believes in the same Jesus you do. Romans 12:5 So we being many are one body in Christ and every one members of another So let us have unity as one body in Jesus Christ who saved us Galatians 5:14 through 15 says For all the law is fulfilled in one word even this Thou shalt love thy neighbor as thyself But if ye bite and devour one another Take heed that ye be not consumed one of another. Maybe you realize you need to repent of this sin. Take some time and have a talk with God about it. Maybe you just know you need Jesus. Here's a prayer that you can say for that. Dear Jesus, I believe that you died on the cross for my sins, and that you rose again the third day. Please forgive me for my sins and come into my heart and be Lord of my life. Help me overcome sin in my life and live for you, so I will have joy when I see your glory. In Jesus' name, amen.
Get a Bible and start reading it to learn more of His will so you can live out His holiness in your life. If you are interested in understanding the story of Jesus' life better, you might like Emmanuel by April Marie. You can check it out at any of these websites, also included in the video description. Thank you for watching. May you be united with your fellow believers.